And Nina, not looking quite as scorching as last week. No, temperature's fairly typical for this time of year over the next couple of days. It felt warm today in that sunshine. We had blue skies across us. This was the scene today in Hastings and the beach in Broadstairs again. Bast in that glorious sunshine where temperatures climbed to around about 24 degrees. But low pressure is close by. So for the next couple of days, it is going to be cloudier. As a result, it will be cooler. Got the potential for a few showers around with some strong winds, particularly through the day tomorrow. But it won't be raining all of the time and there will be a little bit of brightness in between as well. Through the night to tonight, it's going to stay dry with some clear spells, but still fairly warm. We're looking at temperatures into the early hours, staying at around about 14 to 15 degrees. And we have got some early brightness around. The showers fairly well scattered and mainly across northwestern areas the potential for one or two to be on the heavy side. It will be a blustery day with those winds particularly strong through the channel. They could gust around about 45 to 50 miles an hour at times. With more cloud, the strength of that wind as a result, those temperatures at around 20 to 21 degrees. Here's the low pressure system that's just passing to the north of us. You can see as we go through into Wednesday, it's just steadily creeping northeastwards, but still some influence through the day on Wednesday. So I can't rule out perhaps the odd shower in between something drier and brighter and those winds still fairly noticeable a breezy day in store starting at around 14 to 15 degrees the thickest of the cloud expected during the morning and then into the afternoon as that low continues to pull away some brighter skies to finish off the day and i think on wednesday again we'll finish dry with some sunshine and then those temperatures getting up to around about 20 to 21 degrees after that, it looks like it will then start to settle down once again. So cloudy with a few showers or some rain around at the beginning of the week, then Thursday, Friday and into the weekend. It should be drier with increasing amounts of sunshine. And as a result, then it starts to turn a little bit warmer as well through Friday and into the weekend. We could start to see temperatures creeping back up to around about 23 to 24 degrees. And that's because we start to see those low pressures clearing away high pressure does start to mean that at least that weekend should be drier and brighter and signs of a little bit of warmth beginning to return. Nina, thanks very much thanks, indeed. Nina. Well, I'll be back.